You should be flush with business right now, but please take notice if your leads have dried up, even when it doesn't matter today. This is my online toolbox providing weekly quick tips and reminders in all facets of marketing with an objective to help you grow your business with more quality leads, emphasizing more quality. We target online marketing with a combination of some education, a strategy, and implementation to make things happen. What we want to do is take a few recent topics that have come to the company over the last month and bring it to your attention to take advantage of. We all assume everybody's flush with business and you're mostly spending more time allocating what to do and not necessarily too worried about leads, hopefully if your marketing has been, been in front of your business for many years now, but we still want you to take notice if leads have dried up, even when it doesn't matter today. Here are some examples. Well, we've had some customers tell us that leads stopped, specifically two. And in these two circumstances, both actually were getting leads, but the email servers at the website side were not delivering the communications to the customers. So it was just a quick fix and then the clients logged into their websites they saw that the leads were accumulating they then made phone calls to those prospects to let them know it was a technical glitch and they were able to get right back into business after fixing the technical glitch another one was a little bit more serious where somebody hired an interim employee who made a lot of changes on their own which adversely uh, set the client back we worked helping them to recover on that. Luckily, their business has been steamrolling along, so it really didn't matter. But another was a person who we haven't heard from in almost two years, and their dormancy simply has stopped all of their marketing. They didn't want to hear this, of course, but all of their marketing because too many of their competitors over the last two years just, just kept marching along. So every form of ranking opportunity was diminished to a point that whether the client or I should I say past client liked it or not the reality was the search engines and all of the other indexing indexing mechanisms look like they're not in business and even though they are in business they did look dormant for so long that their rankings fell off uh, the map and so the two people that had one with a technical issue and one who just had an interim employee issue making changes that we were able to recover from they still are doing wonderful everybody was able to recover or is in the process of recovering of the lead slowing lead process slowing down even though it didn't matter but this other past customer didn't like to hear about their dormancy and just to be specific uh, for anyone who's getting this far into the presentation it's been over two years since this person got a single individual Google review it's been over two years since they made a single solitary post on Facebook Instagram YouTube or even Google my business it's been over two years since they've made a single solitary change onto their website so they of course had many reasons why uh, they've just been too busy etc etc all of it just doesn't matter so the complacency simply impacted them uh, they didn't want to hear what it was going to take to recover so i'm assuming that we, they may not even be an ongoing client of ours there's nothing we could do we've worked with thousands over the years so the people who simply go dormant in good times if they don't want to move forward and they think that the good times just keep on rolling and rolling and rolling and also all your competitors are just sitting dormant um that's not true and you simply will become a victim of your dormancy and there's nothing we could do because even the gentleman's voice we could tell that things dried up to a point in an environment that it shouldn't even be the case so we want to remind you whether you have a website or not let's assume you have a website hopefully you do but if you do you have to make sure that there's fresh content being placed on the site preferably in a strategic way but even so you have to show the world that you're moving forward just like a newspaper it must move forward in order to not be dormant but say you don't have a website and you're one of the few who come here specifically to get free advice from everybody indefinitely and you live your life at that free level even if you're living at the free level you better move forward with 
Google My Business. Just get reviews. It is free, but no one could force you to get those reviews. If you're on Facebook and you're just using it uh, randomly and don't really necessarily have a strategy, you still need to make some posts to show the world that you're alive. Same with Instagram or YouTube or any other free mechanism that you're focusing in on. So this is my online toolbox reminding you that even if you're flush with business today, take notice if leads suddenly slow down or completely dry up, even when it doesn't matter. There may be some reasons, some of them technical, some of them operational, and more importantly, you don't want to have your competitors constantly moving forward and having one month turn into a quarter, turn into a year, and God forbid turning into multiple years and then having the search engines and the ranking mechanisms say you're no longer in business. Then the economy changes and all of a sudden all of this flush with business attitude just dissipates and you start to think about new opportunities. That is the absolute wrong time to be thinking about your marketing. Your marketing, even when you're busy, should be in front of your business. Find the time to make little things happen, preferably big things happen, but little things happen on a continuous basis to show the world you're alive. This is my online toolbox reminding you to please like us on our Facebook page, subscribe to us on our YouTube channel. Remember to start planning yesterday for next year's marketing and profits. Have a healthy week and we will see you next week.